What's up everyone, we're back for another episode of ReZero and last episode we all saw Subaru's beautiful confession towards Amelia and it even ended with a kiss but quickly the moments got ruined because when they walked outside Garfield was right fucking there waiting for them. I mean I just hope that Otto and Ram are okay that he just knocked them out or something. I mean, Ram, she's probably fine, but Otto, I mean, he's already been killed by Garfield a couple of times, I think. So yeah, we all know that he actually is capable and willing to straight up kill Otto. Anyway, so much has happened in this loop that it would be heartbreaking for Subaru to die. But anyways, let's just start watching this episode. What the hell is this? Oh, is that a Ryuzu? And little baby Garfield? Oh, the moment that talked about. Holy shit, it traumatized him that much? Oh, that's how he got the scar. He did it himself. Hold up, smash the entrance? Yeah, that's their only way out. Yeah, of course he doesn't give a shit. Yo, we haven't seen Amelia fight in a while. And she doesn't have Puck to help out. Oh, they're just gonna talk? <laughs> Calling him out? Yo, calling him out on his insecurities. Till today? Yo! That's right, how many times has she gone in the trial? This guy's like 15 years older than since when he did it, and he's still crying about it. Natsuki family. <laughs> That's right, he did nothing but be a little coward. Little bitch. So this man is getting called out for being a disappointment in his family. Look at him, he can't even talk. Oh, this man's about to cry, isn't he? Or get punched. He loves his mother? And we've never seen so much emotion out of him. Blaming himself? Oh, no. No, that's kind of fucked up because when parents leave their kids, this is exactly what they think. Even saw their freaking bodies dead? The man was actually okay with being left behind as long as it made her mom happy. Never thought Garfield would almost make me cry. All right, looks like he's even more motivated now. <laughs> Great. This 
This man still has the mind of a child. Well, it looks like beast mode is out. I have no clue how Subaru's gonna get out of this one. <laughs> Total submission? You gotta love his confidence. Wait, why is he going straight for him? Oh, Shamak? Yo, does that even do damage? What did he just do? <laughs> Yo, what is this man doing? Where's he getting all this power from? He poked him? <laughs> oh, so that's what happened. <laughs> that's right. I'm really impressed with Subaru in these three episodes. Right, we still have to see what happened with Amelia in the trial. And yeah, he knows that. Sometimes you just gotta ask help. Still have to punch him in the face, huh? Yo, he took that shit like a man! <laughs> Yo, bleeding from the nose, the mouth, and he doesn't care, he's still standing. Strong as hell, and he lost the goddamn tooth. Holy shit, and they're putting that action music? That's right, isn't that right, Ram? We still haven't forgotten about you. I don't think he could take two punches. Wait, what? What's going on with him? What the hell? What is he doing? Hold up! Yo, is this man learning how to control his power? Holy shit. Yo, he can use those freaking invisible hands now? Yeah, he looks like he's broken. He can barely stand. Oh shit! Oh my god! Yeah, his back has to be broken. <laughs> oh, she's getting revenge. <laughs> sweet, sweet revenge. Yo, he's finally understanding. Yeah, because that was Betelgeese's power. It's a pretty powerful power, I gotta say. If he learns to use it, that'll be very good for him. <laughs> oh, he's already giving it names, yo! <laughs> he's all ready for it. Hey, we haven't seen, seen this in a while. Oh, Otto! Well, at least he's fine. <laughs> he's mad at him. <laughs> well, I mean, what was he supposed to do? <laughs> oh, what the hell? He's on Ram's lap. <laughs> I wonder if this is the first time that he's done this. 
<laughs> of course. <laughs> oh, really now? Oh, yeah, that probably broke his heart. <gasps> She's just straight up breaking this man's heart. <laughs> But she's giving advice. <laughs> Was that a pun? <laughs> well, yeah. Well, if he wants to continue to be alone, then let him think that. Oh shit. After all these years? He's probably never, never even thought about going back. Oh, Garfield going in the trial? Never would have would have expected this. Well, she can be nice. Yeah, he's probably so scared of this place and has been avoiding it all this time. Oh, it's about to start. And of course it's this place. And of course it's that moment. Wait, that's Garfield as a baby. So are we going to learn the reason why she actually left them? Aw, and then those little necklace things were from their mother? Well, Frederica seems to understand. Yeah, it's probably heartbreaking to see that. Oh, she wanted to bring their father back. Then, how did she die? What? Yeah, I guess Garfield did assume why his mother left them. But he's now learning that he was wrong. Yeah, but he's got to accept it. That's his trial, I guess. That's right. You got to mature. And he's always going to have that scar there to remember it. And hopefully they'll be able to see each other again. He wants to live up to people's expectations. That was a beautiful trial, Garfield. You're making me tear up. <laughs> Didn't even use the stairs, just jumped straight over. <laughs> we may have changed his mindset, but it didn't change his personality. That's right, now it's Amelia's turn. <laughs> was probably <laughs> just accepted. <laughs> That's right, and to Subaru. <laughs> and he's blushing. 
Still blushing. Kind of looked like he was straight up about to kiss him right there. <laughs> yeah, how old is he? He's 14? <laughs> In the 8th grade, that's how he looks at it. The species grow up really fast. <laughs> What about it? <laughs> oh, she's saying it means a lot to her? <laughs> Hold up. They're gonna talk about their relationship afterwards? This is finally it. A moment Emilia passes the trial. Yeah, I was wondering why he acted like a child. Oh, he's apologizing as well? This man really changed. When he was talking with Otto? In episode one? Wait! What the fuck? He's not talking about what I think he's talking about, is he? Why is he saying that shit? What the hell? Yo, Garfield's a funny guy now, huh? I love it. Oh, let's just hope everything goes well. Oh, they're in the woods. Oh, she's being ruthless with Amelia, huh? Hold up, witch's daughter? The frozen witch? She's a witch? What? Well, she's a witch who's trying to change and be human. I wonder if Amelia remembering that she's actually a frozen witch. I think that's what they called it. But I wonder if that's one of the memories that was sealed. Which is why she had never mentioned it, or we never knew anything about that. Either way, she seems very confident right now, and she's ready for this trial. So I hope everything is going to be fine, and that the memories that she has gained have not affected her at all, and have in fact helped her and made her stronger. But that's going to be for next episode. This episode right here, it was focused more on Garfield, and at first... He was doing everything that he can to stop this trial and the sanctuary from being open. He was just stuck on his past, on what happened with his mother, thinking that his mother left him and Frederica because she wanted to be happy and that leaving outside caused the death. I mean, it was a whole bunch of shit, but throughout all his life, he basically stuck with that idea. And right now, he just wanted to put an end to it, and he was going to straight up destroy the entrance to the sanctuary. Luckily, Subaru did stop him with that necklace, which made him transform back into a human. And then afterwards, by taking that punch from Garfield. Garfield is a strong man, I mean, he's killed people. <laughs> We've seen him kill people, so for Subaru to just straight up take a punch like that, lose blood and lose a tooth and still be standing on his own two feet looking at him in the eyes yeah i'm sure even garfield was impressed by that and then afterwards he woke up on ram's lap gained a bit of confidence to finally 
take the trial again after all these years, after all the pain that it had caused him. Although Subaru did tell him like, look at Amelia. She also suffers whenever she takes a trial, but she keeps coming back. She keeps trying and she keeps fighting. So Garfield finally stopped being a wimp. He took the trial. He learned the truth about his mother and he accepted it. He walked out a different man. He looks at Subaru like an older brother now. He's even starting to crack jokes with Subaru. Although that joke at the end, that was just freaking weird how he said that. Because of that, he's okay with losing to Subaru. Like what? This man actually got impressed by Subaru. Gosh, what an ending. Anyways, a super nice episode. They gave Garfield some very impressive character development now. And I'm sure that from now on, he's going to be an important and fun character for this anime. Anyways, I'll see you in the next episode and I hope you guys stick around.